but I'm gonna show you guys in this magic wall animation what can happen to you. You all may remember last year, I actually went on a project unhealthy. In five days, I gained eight pounds. In five days, I actually became hypertensive, developed high blood pressure. I don't even want to know what was going on inside my body. America, listen up. This is what you're doing to yourself. I did it for five days. I felt miserable. I gained weight. I put my body in jeopardy, and it wasn't worth it. And you know what? I'm never going to do it again. Why did I do it? To prove a point. When you eat these foods, it causes an addictive pattern in your mind. But in the end, all you end up is overweight, lethargic, and not feeling good about yourself. This is me. So what happened when I ate a fast food meal? Well, something very simple. The contents enter your stomach, and I'm gonna circle some of these contents that I call some of the killer contents of food. Sodium. These are fat molecules. These are refined sugar molecules. No big deal, right? Well, it is a big deal because when they hit your stomach, good things start happening, believe it or not. That's that dopamine release in your brain because dopamine and serotonin are going wild. You feel great. Oh my gosh, this tastes wonderful. It does, right, for the first few minutes. But things are also going on inside your body that aren't so great. Your pancreas is secreting more and more insulin to deal with that massive sugar overload from the fries, from the white bun, from the soda. Insulin does one thing, it drives sugar into cells, but it does something else, it tells your body to store fat. Why else would you have eaten a meal that big and that many calories unless you're about to go into hibernation? That's what you do when you hibernate, you grow a big belly. That, that fat that you see here, those fat cells actually grow in size. They start to secrete even more toxic substances, leading to heart disease, diabetes, and so many other things. All that sodium causes your blood pressure to go up, so your heart's beating twice as fast against twice as much resistance. And in your brain, you no longer are releasing dopamine, but instead, your brain is signaling you to release cortisol. Cortisol is a chronic stress hormone that ironically tells you to store even more fat. And last, but certainly not least, what isn't going on in my brain right now? I'm 30 minutes after my meal. There's no more dopamine. There's no more serotonin. I'm lethargic. I feel unhappy, I don't feel good about myself, and that is why when you first eat a fast food meal, you feel great, and 30 minutes later, you feel terrible. Oh yeah. Kim. <laughs> yes. After everything you have heard here today, would you be willing to try to make some changes? Yes. Wow. I'm gonna give you a copy of this book, The Lean Belly Prescription. The reason I'm gonna okay. do it is because this has foods in it that taste great, that are also good for you. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Kim, for being such thank a great you. sport.